Hey, what's going on guys? It's Dragon Knight here, and today we are going to be playing some more Titanfall 2. Now, when we last left off on episode 4, we actually, um, uh, we discovered the Ark and whatever, that power source, uh, as you guys saw. But, this episode we're just gonna be, uh, continuing. But without further ado, let's just get right into this. Pilot Cooper, Anderson is dead, but we can complete his mission if we can re-establish contact with the fleet. The interstellar beacon ahead will serve our needs. Seems like BT just climbed up that mountain. Let's hope someone on our side Damn. is listening oh. out there. Oh. There's only one way to find out. That was close. Uphold the mission. Pilot, I see the beacon up ahead. So we're looking for the beacon now. That's it. Scans detect minimal power functionality. It may need repairs. Looks Caution. like we're just following BT. Multiple contacts. Hostiles confirmed. The stalkers appear to be programmed to attack the control room. Damn, BT over here. Let's kick some ass. I want to take control. I detect traces of poisonous chemicals within the fog. Pilot control initiated. Yeah, since there's uh, poisonous chemicals, I have to stay inside of BT. I can handle it. Unlikely pilot. The fog is deadly to organic life. Okay. Um, we're actually gonna go with a Ronin. We cannot uphold the mission if you are dead. You will be safe in the cockpit. Pilot, I'm detecting militia forces inside that beacon control room. They are signaling distress. Patching in. Hey! So. Come up there. I recommend we help eliminate these stalkers and then make direct contact with the militia riflemen. Okay, let's do it. Forty ton. So I guess we got a. Whoa. Okay. Threat neutralized. Well done. This victory has raised our combat efficiency rating. Nice. Seven two seven four to militia forces. All threats have been eliminated. Kept on coming. We may not have lasted much longer. We're opening the blast doors. Come on in. Oh, he wants us to come in. Okay. The blast doors are open, pilot. Come on in. We're trying to send a signal, but the beacon was hit hard. We're having some trouble bringing it back online. Okay. There's BT. Captain, what is the status of the beacon? The power is shut down. We've lost all control of the beacon. We need something like this to jumpstart the system, but this one's destroyed. Designation, arc tool. Function, generates power up to five megajoules. Yeah, yeah, we know what it is. Can you repair it? Megajoules. Nah, we already tried. <laughs> Sensors indicate another one in the substation, but it's nearly impossible to get down there. This place just ain't built for humans. Understood. Pilot Cooper, I advise caution while navigating this facility substation. You must recover the arc tool. Okay. Good luck, sir. Hope you make it back. We've lost too many down there. We were just four. Yep. Good luck, pilot. What's this guy we're doing over here? Turn. So it seems like we're gonna have to go down to the substation or whatever so we can get another uh tool to start up the beacon. So I guess let's do it. I wonder how deep this facility goes. Looks like they're setting up uh, checkpoints. 
pilot or stalker. The hell is that? Careful, people. He stalked The last pilot in our unit went that way a few hours ago, but he never came back. Be careful. Um, I don't know what this is. Okay, that's obviously not the way. Um, <laughs> I mean, it was worth a shot, right? Pilot, I have patched into your helmet display to monitor your progress. The channel is open if you need assistance. BT, what's up with these walls? Scanning. Exposed power circuits. You should avoid physical contact. Proceed forward with caution. Got it. BT, remind me what I'm doing here. Your mission is to obtain an arc tool. Using it, we can jumpstart the power systems and get the beacon back online. Scans detected signature further within this facility substation. See this? Softball. Better try this out, shall we, guys? This. Oh. I like this already. Okay, you know what? We'll just use this. Okay, this does not look safe. Let's take these guys out first before we go even farther. Going invisible. They have no idea we're here. Okay, those are not the guys we want to mess with. Look at my little robot go. He's like, let's go kick some ass, guys. Look at this. Get down, bitch. Adios. <laughs> oh, that's good. Okay, we got one out to pilot helmets. We definitely want to be collecting those, because why not, you know? Might as well if we see it. Okay. Wonder why our signals? It's probably because we're going deeper and deeper. Yep. Maze down here. How deep does this thing go? Scans reveal a maximum depth of 300 meters. Gosh, 300 meters. What is this place? The station's computer details this location as the power grid for an IMC interstellar beacon. Okay, what's this? Okay, so I don't think we want to go there. Disable the turbine. You know what? I guess we have no choice. Adi, let's go. Oh, this is so cool. Man, that was cool. I don't want to shut it down. That's like a lot of fun. I can just like, whoop. Flying around like a savage. Okay, I guess we don't have a choice. I'm running out of ammunition. Oh, great. Okay, and fire. Fire. There we go. Is there any other guns up here? And there is not. Is there? No? Okay. I'll you! One. 
We go over here. I need a new weapon though. I don't think I want to go to that because that will probably wreck me, so I'm gonna play it safe and stay on the stairs. Looks like it's not even that bad. Sorry buddy, I need this. Aw, he's sad. You have acquired the arc tool. Return to the control room. We are ready to jumpstart the system. Wow. Did I just stop it? Okay. I understand exactly what this does. So, if I shoot it long enough, it'll stop it just so I can get past. You see that, guys? That's gonna come in handy. Can you reverse it? Huh. No! Okay, you know what? Let's try this again. Wall running is always an option. Oh, where do we gotta go? We gotta go even more? Where do we have to go? Do we have to go there? Uh, I think we do. Okay. Let's come back down. Come on, okay, I got an okay, I got those guys, don't worry. Watch this. Okay, we did it. Nice. Let's make our way over here. Please tell me this does something to him. Screw you guys. Okay, at least we got that. Okay, that's not gonna go away good. Oh. How are we supposed to do this? Okay. Oh, here we go. The store opened up. Okay, nice. So we're going to have to activate that to put up that shield. Okay, we made it underneath. Nice. Oh, the hell? I just got knocked all the way back. Did you guys see that? Okay, got a blast. Oh, okay, good thing that wall's there. Oh, nice. Okay. I don't have to worry too much. What's blocking me? How am I even supposed to? Okay, I'm guessing if I jump there, it's gonna land me on that wall, so... Let's try it. No! Okay, my calculations were incorrect. Try it again. Oh my god, okay. Let's try this. What the hell? Ah, uh, okay, give me a second, guys. What happens if we throw our robot here? He just went flying back. Okay, let's just go. Come on! Here we go. We did it. Back off, dude. I will turn you into, I don't know, electric five much. Okay, uh, do I really want to go here? Stay down, stay down. Okay, where do I go? Hurry up.
the hell? Cause that's a good idea. Are you? Oh boy. Oh gosh. Talk about speed. Gotta go fast. That's crazy. Come on. Can I get the comeback? No! Okay, I got this, don't worry guys. That would have been cool if I still could have done that. I didn't have enough uh, momentum though. That was impressive, pilot. The way it's going back to control. He's got the arc two. We got the arc two guys. Let's do this. That's not in the pilot handbook. Pilot's back, and that looks like an arc tool to me. I think we just got our ticket off, Mister. Good work, Pilot Cooper. Now we can jumpstart the power to get the beacon functional. Cable secure, Captain. Glad you made it back, Cooper. Just in time, too. The system's rewired. Now all we need is some power. Pilot, the power chamber relays are offline. The arc tool should be able to jumpstart them manually. Cooper, okay. let's hope that arc tool was worth all the trouble. Oh. <laughs> Caution. High radiation levels detected ahead. Look at all this. Will only protect you for a limited time inside the chamber. I suggest you move quickly. I wouldn't stay in there too long unless you want to be burnt to a crisp. Okay, okay guys. Opening the hatch in three, two, Gotta go fast. Guys, I don't know if we're gonna make it. I recommend you exit the chamber immediately. Close it. Great job. Oh. The power is back. We did it, All guys. Right, we got power. Open those shutters. Let's get that beacon up and running. Diagnostic complete. Power 100 percent Initiate dish targeting reset. Uplink targeting module. Reset initiated. 60%. A calling CQ. Power the beacon. Warning. Fault detected. Emergency shutdown. Oh, you gotta be shitting me. What's going on? Talk to me. Not sure. Some sort of fail state. The hell. The uplink targeting module is offline. Not good. I bet the IMC are on their way. That is a reasonable assumption. Accord, can we bypass the module? No, sir. Not unless we want to send a message to the entire IMC fleet. Then the module is going to have to be repaired manually. Pilot, this situation could use your skills. I hope you're up for a Seems like trip every to situation you. needs my skills. We need to repair the beacon on site and get back here as fast as possible. Let's go, BT. Rock and roll. Pilot mode engaged. The hell did I just do? Okay. Oh. I got confused, I wanted to reload my weapon, but I'm actually going to change to the, um, we'll keep this, actually. Be careful. We've already lost a lot of good soldiers over there. Scans indicate a fallen pilot. My memory recalls this pilot as an exceptional fighter, proven well during the fracture operation. What's Fracture? Fracture was the code name of a major combat refueling operation conducted by the militia on the planet Victor. We sustained many casualties, but the fleet survived. Damn. Wow. So, where are we supposed to go? Um. Yeah, I'll probably have to do this myself, huh? Okay. And I apparently have the arc tool. Go on, BT.
Where's BT going? My scans detect a functioning uplink targeting module, 428 meters northeast. My analysis indicates a throw is our only option here. I can throw you across the gap. You have got to be kidding me. Are you sure about this? There is a 68% chance of success. <laughs> what about the other 32%? You gotta be kidding. There is a 32% chance of an incomplete traversal, resulting in catastrophic trauma, massive internal bleeding, and multiple compound fractures. Wow, well, that's just... Dismemberment may also occur. That just makes me feel even better, BT. electrocution and disintegration within the toxic fog below. You know, whatever, let's just do this. Ali three Wait. knots heading two seven four range ninety five meters projectile mass eighty nine kilograms. But anyways, guys, if you enjoyed, don't forget to leave a like, maybe even subscribe. I really do appreciate all the support. Sorry to leave you guys on a cliffhanger, but next episode you're gonna be finding out what happens when BT throws me and everything like that, and if we can repair it or not. But hopefully you guys enjoyed. I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Peace out.